Hi guys, I'm not a mob. I want to first and foremost categorically clarify that I'm not part of any political outfit. I'm not part of Azimio. I'm not part of UDA. Our agenda is Kenya. Our agenda is Kenyans. Our agenda is the livelihood of Kenyans. Our agenda is UNGA. Our agenda is kerosene. Our agenda is taxes. Our agenda is money in the pockets of Kenyans. Hunger does not discriminate. Hunger does not care whether you're a Kikuyu, a Luo, a Mijikenda, a Kisi, or a Luya. Your landlord does not care whether you're an ODM or Jubilee. Tokens or electricity does not care which tribe you come from. Stima ikiisha, pesa ikiisha, uko peke yako. Nyumba ikifungwa, inafungwa ukiwa peke yako. So our agenda is very clear that we need money and food on the table of every Kenyan in this country. Mr. President. God answered your prayers. You went around this country campaigning in churches and you prayed you're a believer and God answered your prayers and you're now the president. Time for prayers are over. Even God expects you to serve his people because he gave you the authority and you have the ability to deliver to them. No more prayers, Mr. President, with all humility. No more prayers. First and foremost, thank you very much, Mr. President, for lowering the prices of Unga. We appreciate but that is not enough. Kenyans are still suffering. Mr. President, I went to the parliament and they did not hear me. I went to the parliament and they did not receive me. If you're a Kenyan out there and you have a CV, please print it. Whether you're from Kitale, from Mombasa, from Malindi, print your CV. If you're a Kenyan out there and you have rent arrears, please talk to your landlord and ask them to give you an official letter that says you've not paid your rent. If you're a parent and you've not paid your school fees for your children, go to the headmaster or the headmistress. Get a stamped copy of the fee structure. We are going to State House to take these documents to our lovely president.